There are no for sale signs, but the word is out. This nice little town north of Atlanta can be yours for a mere $14 million. It is Brazelton, population 500, 2,000 acres, 85% owned by the Brazelton family. What do you get for your $14 million? All of downtown, which includes a furniture store, supermarket, and dry goods store, all named Brazelton, of course. There's a new bank that is doing quite well with $4 million in deposits. An old blacksmith shop ready for occupancy. A compact police station with patrol car. Hundreds of acres of prime farm and industrial land, plus other enterprises. It all began 94 years ago with one store at a crossroads. Surviving sons of the three founding Brazelton brothers are getting on in years now, with no one interested in succeeding them as they did their fathers. So the Brazelton boys felt they had to sell. Someone asked me, did I want to sell it? And I asked them, did you want to, would you want to sell your soul? Boy, this now breaks my heart. But uh, sometimes you've got to follow what the majority wants to do of the, of the, of the firm, you know. The senior cousin, 82-year-old Brazzy Brazelton, also does not look forward to giving up the family business. I'll tell you what I'll do is whoever buys it, if they'll let me come and work, uh, stay around, I won't charge them anything. I'll work for nothing. Some of the townspeople wonder how the sale will affect them. It kind of worries me in a way because I live here and I don't know what the future's going to hold for us. You know, we rent here, you know, and we don't know if we'll have to move or what. The Brazilians hope the buyer will retain the 50 to 60 people who work for them and not change the name of the place. They figure that's not too much to ask for a town of your own, along with $14 million, of course. Al Dale, ABC News, Brazelton, Georgia.